What's going on guys, Orzio here, welcome back to a brand new video. So today we have got the new shapeshifter player SBC card that EA just released and it is going to be Felipe Anderson to review. He's looking incredible, he has got 99 pace with 97 dribbling, 93 shooting, 94 passing with 83 physicals and EA have changed so much about Felipe Anderson. He used to be a left winger and now he is a right winger. He used to have medium medium work crates and now he has got high medium work crates. He used to be right footed and now he is left footed and he used to have four star skill moves and now he has got five star skill moves and he still has that four star weak foot to his game now the chem style marksman i feel like marksman is so perfect for this card because you're giving him 99 finishing while also upgrading his dribbling stats while also giving him a really really nice increase to the strength as well so i definitely feel like the marksman chem style is the way to go the pace it's, ma it's maxed out. You can't get any better. The shooting stats look incredible. He has got 94 attacking positioning with 99 finishing, 99 shot power, 99 long shots, 92 volleys with 74 penalties. And it, it doesn't stop there. He also has got the finesse shot trait as well. His passing ability looks unreal. His dribbling ability looks beautiful. And now he's obviously got five-star skill moves. His uh, physicals, I mean, that 87 strength with the marksman chem style is going to be really nice to have down the line he has got 91 stamina as well and he also has got 95 aggression but look at the defending stats he's got 80 standing tackling with 94 interceptions that is something you don't see very often on a winger now when it comes down to links oh yeah forgot to tell you guys i don't know why but the shapeshifter card is completely glitched right now and it's just gone massive I have no idea how that ended up, but hey, it is what it is. We move past it. The Lynx, Brazilian nationality. You guys already know how good that is in this game. The club he plays for, Lazio. You can link him up with like a Mobile. You can link him up with like Milinkovic Savage. So the club ain't too bad either. Now, when it comes down to positions, I will be playing Felipe Anderson in three positions. I'm going to be playing him in a striker position down the line. And I also want to try out this card in a cam position as well. So let's get into the games and let's see how good this card is going to be. Look at top left corner. Is that how they're showing Felipe Anderson's card? Yeah, it's completely, completely glitched out. They're probably going to fix it very soon. But yeah, that doesn't look right. He's going to push towards me. He is. I see Felipe Anderson making a bit of movement there. Go on, accelerate around him. Perfect. Accelerate into the space. Who we'll rolled that for that driven pass over to CR7, but we couldn't get it to go. But nice, uh, nice movement from him there. I like how he didn't say central. He was uh, moving to the sides. I'm going to go with an early Burba spin here. I need a passing option now. Felipe Anderson is trying to come short, as you guys clearly see. He makes a good run there, though. But look at that movement. Beautiful ball roll. Go for that power shot to towards the near post. And we do end up getting ourselves our first goal with him. Beautiful movement. Just like sometimes making a run in behind, realizing he's not going to get the ball though really quickly. And then giving me that passing option once again. He's got so many players inside the box. I'm trying to find like an angle. I see Ronaldo's run there. Touch it. Extra pass into Felipe Anson. Nice fake shot. Let's go for that fake shot down as well. Just trust in that weaker foot now. And he is going to miss the opportunity. Great dribbling though. Like how he gave me that passing option as well. Let's go for our tactic. Hit it all the way back. Is he going to cover it? He hasn't covered it. We got a finesse shot. Come on. Green time. He's got the finesse shot trait as well. But this one is going to hit the crossbar. Good animation though. Very good animation. Is he offside? He might have just ran offside. He doesn't. All right. Hold on. Hold on a second. We might have a an opportunity. Go on. Inside as well. No. He read that. He, oh, okay, that's that's good defending for my opponent. That's yeah, there's not much else I can say about that. Felipe Anderson there though with the skill moves felt really, really good. I just still cannot believe he got a block and he got a block in there. I want to see if I can get Felipe Anderson in like a finesse shot angle. He's sitting here on the edge of the box and there's no one coming towards him. And once again, it is a good finesse shot. The angle isn't anything amazing. Usually the finesse shots down the middle, they sometimes go in, but it's quite rare. Ronaldo's making a run there. Let's go for a through ball because I see Felipe Anderson making a bit of movement. Go for an elastico. Nice touch. Accelerate into the middle. I like how we use the strength there against Dante to hold him off. And once again, and that's just a good pass over to Fernandinho and we get the goal there. Just using his strength to hold off players. I need an option. Ronaldo. Nice scoop turn. Felipe Anderson. Extra. I tried to scoop it, but it fake shotted it. It doesn't matter. We got it on that stronger foot and it flies right into the corner. Or I'll scoop that. There you go. Felipe Anderson waiting for it. Go for that quick sombrero. Green timed. Oh my. 
That would have been, that would have been something special. The sombrero came off perfectly. You saw the animation, the defender got in as well. We even green timed it. We did everything we could. Let's go for a turn here because I don't really want to go down the line with Fabinho. Accelerate into the space. Nice. He does use his strength a good amount and that's something I am liking the looks of. But look at that for a finesse shot. None timed as well. Can I get maybe round him? I don't think so. I'm going to go for that cutback. I see Fabinho coming in. Fernandinho, good fake shot. Felipe Anderson, beautiful. Trust in that four-star weak foot. No, it's going to get blocked. The movement, though, I'm telling you guys, is something I am loving in that striker position. He knows when to come short, and he knows when to make that running behind. Like, look at him right now. He's moving all over the place. He's trying to give me a passing option. Like, down, he's trying to give me a passing option up as well. Get that ball for Bingo. Extra pass down. Let's go for a dummy there. Go on. Use that pace. Keep it going. I'm going to go for this. I red-timed it. It was a hard angle, right? And it just smacks the keeper in the face. Like, what animation is that? I definitely do want to test out his passing ability. So, let's go for a switcher play here. All the way over. Look at that for a pass. That's, his, that's with his weaker foot as well. And it looks like this guy's giving me the free W. Okay. I guess I'll take it. Give that through ball there. There you go. That's a nice turn as well. Come on. Use that pace against Alfonso Davis as well. And he just comes over and completely takes me out. I like how we outpaced Alfonso Davis there, though. I see him all the way on the edge of the box. Let's go for this. Smack it. Go on. With the weak foot. And it was that good. Hold on. Let's go for it again. I don't know if that player on the edge of the box, yeah, he's going to cover it this time. Let's still try to get it to him. Driven that all the way up. Go for this. No, I tried to hit that under his legs. For some odd reason, I'm playing two players. I didn't realize. <laughs> nice pass into Mane. Extra pass into Felipe Anderson. We got plenty of space to run into. Ball referee. He handballed that. 100% he handballed that. Go for a ball roll scoop. Felipe Anderson dropping really deep to get this ball. Let's go for that through ball and look at that for a pass. Son. Nah, Son just, just takes a bad touch. But still, the pass was incredible. Let's go for a ball roll scoop there. Dummy that. Nice turn. Good pass. No way. Can we get it still? We have got it. We hit it first time, and it's an amazing finish. I'm kind of surprised he got a little touch to that. Driven that straight into Fernandinho here. Extra pass into Felipe Anderson. Nice ball roll scoop towards that near post, trusting in that four-star weak foot, and we get another goal with him. He's shooting inside the box. is amazing. Felipe Anderson. Nice fake shot. Go on, let's power shot this. Green timed. I just wanted to see. Like, he's got 99 long shots. He's got 99 shot power as well. So I wanted to see if that was going to go in. We could go for the finesse shot tactic. Is he going to read it? Is he? I don't think he is. Hold on a second. We've got ourselves... <laughs> we got ourselves an opportunity and it ended up yellow timing it. And look how bad of a yellow time shot it was. Into Ronaldo. Extra pass into Felipe Anderson. I'm going to accelerate round for round. Go on. Just use that pace. Keep it going. We'll roll that. Maybe I could get round for run again. Nah, he defended well. He defended really, really well. His skill moves, as I said, do come off nicely. But I'm definitely noticing a bit of weird movement with the left stick dribbling. I'm going to dribble that straight into him. There you go. Good touch. Once again, just use his pace. Keep it going. Keep it going. Look at his strength. That's something that you're not going to get off a lot of wingers. Him just using his strength there to hold off. Who is this? Marquinhos? Go on, accelerate round. Referee. Referee! That has to be a foul. Play that through ball. There you go. Son was wide open. I'm going to play that back to Ronaldo. I need Felipe Anderson to just come back, in, come back on side. And we do get the finish. Kind of surprised he didn't use his right foot there. Like, I put it onto his right side so he can use his right foot. But as long as it goes in, I'm happy. I'm going to play it up here. Son is wide open. Good turn. Extra pass. Is he... On side, I think he is, and what a save from Allison! That's incredible. Ronaldo, there you go. I'm gonna send Felipe Anderson on a run. Did I mistime it? I think I did. Wait, hold on. Apparently, I didn't. Nice ball roll scoop. Just keep it calm here. See if I can accelerate around him. Good use of strength. No, the touch right at the end. I mean, he did pretty well to get around two players. I just uh, was overdoing it, trying to get around the whole team. We're gonna go for this again. I think I've gone for this like twice already. And I've mistimed it twice. So let's see if I can time it good this time. He's finesse shots. Yeah, they are a joke. Even though they haven't flew in every time, I can see the animation. 
it's like a good animation. It's the animation you want to see off a finesse shot. So it is time to give my final thoughts on the card. We ended up playing seven games with Felipe Anderson and we scored seven goals in those seven games and we also came out with a single assist as well. Now the first thing I want to speak about is his dribbling ability. The dribbling ability on this card was really nice in most cases but I felt like there was definitely certain angles when I was going for the left stick dribbles uh, that felt a little bit slow when trying to go for that turn. So you definitely do notice a few turns feel a little bit awkward and I definitely feel like it's because of his unique body type. But the skill moves on this card, oh yeah, they came off really really good like the ball roll scoop turn came off so fast the mcgee has been cancelled the reverse elastico the normal elastico came off really really well with him it's just the left stick dribbling i mean in most cases it felt good it's just there definitely was certain turns that felt a little bit slow with him his passing ability insane you guys saw the over top through balls come out of play it was just beautiful how how he would just switch the ball and it would land perfectly onto uh onto son or onto Mane. i believe those two are playing down the line so yeah passing ability loved it shooting ability incredible inside the box the amount of power behind the shots were really 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 good and he's a four star weak foot felt very nice as well i don't think there was a single four star weak foot shot today that felt a little bit off let's say you know when you have a four star weak foot player you shoot the ball and it just goes straight past the post no Felipe Anderson I'm pretty sure he got it on target every single time and his finesse shots even though we scored I think it was only two today maybe three you can definitely tell the animation when going for the finesse shot is very, very good. And it's the animation you want to see when going for a finesse shot. So yeah, the shooting ability, I was really happy with it. The pace, loved these pace. So easy to get in behind, just sprinting past players for fun. His physicals, you guys saw the strength. The strength was really nice on this card because... It allowed me to get in front of players with a certain skill move and then just hold them off for as long as I need, needed to hold them off for. So yeah, the strength was really nice to work with down the line and the aggression, the 95 aggression, you can definitely tell he has got that as well because he's always fighting for it and he's coming out with 50-50s the majority of the time as well. Now the price of this card, 190k. 190,000 coins is really good pricing. Like... He's Brazilian. He's an amazing player and he's also got five star skill moves as well. So yeah, 190k, I do believe it is worth it. If we're comparing him to players in this Serie A, in the right wing position, I feel like the best comparison we can do is Berardi because I know a lot of people use Berardi in this game as well. Uh, who would I go for? I think I would go Felipe Anderson, especially with Felipe Anderson having that amazing finesse shot to his game while also having the five-star skill moves as well. I definitely feel like Felipe Anderson is a card I would take over Berardi. So yeah, Felipe Anderson, shapeshifter, is the best right winger in this Serie A. Do I believe he is the best winger in this Serie A? No, I do not believe he is better than Insigne. And I don't actually believe he is better than Liao as well. I feel like Liao is a level above this uh, Felipe Anderson card as well. Now, where does he go in the attacker's tier list? He is an S tier, but I definitely, definitely will say he goes into the A plus tier comfortably. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like, make sure to leave a comment. But for now, peace.